Hello, this is Dickerson and Hartley welcoming you to uh, Cove Road in Malham. So we've got a three bedroom semi detached house here uh, with parking to the front and garden as you can see. Um, the locale of this property, fantastic just being able to get the cove just up the road there and great access to, to be able to do so. Um, so as we stretch up here you can see the garden to the front, nice, nice big space there. And then heading up the side, so this is the parking um, for the house that we're walking up just now. Um, which doesn't have a uh, doesn't have a front door as such. The door is on the side, so we're going to wander in, in through here. So into the hallway area, um, which leads up the stairs that way, and we've got a little bit of storage space underneath as well. Um, but then into the uh, living room here. So for the heat burning stove, really nicely presented here yeah. and dining room around this side with again a nice space and looking out into the garden but the space all in here is exceptionally good as you wander around you see the whole size of all together doing that and then this wanders around and through into the kitchen area so a nice space here it's a nice modern unit either side and all the way around garden out to the back which we will, we will see in just a minute but another bad view when you're doing your, uh, your washing up um, there's also an, uh, another utility room stroke second kitchen out there as well which we'll come back to as we wander around. So we're up the stairs from here. Uh, there's a little, little window there. And up we go. We've got the bathroom first day eh, as we go up the stairs here. So this is three piece suite so there's a P-shaped bath with the with the shower over it. There's the heated towel rail and then the other two piece suite. But enough room for a bit of storage as well. You can see as you go, and we've got a bedroom. So on the corner here, so this is the third bedroom. A bit of a storage cupboard in there, and still enough to take a double bed in here. So good, good enough size on, on that side of things. Um, and then you see this little bit of a view of the garden from from here. So I'll just have a little look out there in a minute. But uh, good space. And we wander around here. Got master bedroom, really nicely presented. Your storage cupboards either side of the chimney breast there. And, uh, space for furniture and plenty of it. Yeah, and I say we've got a bit of a view out there of a little back hall up there and uh, the cove in the distance. So we're going to around there and back. And then the final bedroom in this house, it, not dissimilar size to the uh, the one we've just seen, but full of boxes for uh, moving at present. So not presented fantastically, but uh, you know you can kind of see where the size and space is. As I say, exactly the same as the other one next door. So pretty good there. So that's that. What we're going to do is we're going to wander down. We're going to wander out to the uh, the garden, and also that utility room that's accessed through the back as well. I'll wander through here. So the doorway out here, we've got a bit of a covered area here. Yeah, so, uh, logs, stores and coals. Um, garden going that way. We'll, we'll have a look into this kitchen area here. Which, uh, a big utility room. It used to be used as a, a sort of functioning kitchen really for a business. Um, so it's a really good space if you've got a business or something like that. Um, and it's, it's nicely done and really nicely fitted out. A uh, good bit of storage in there as well. And let's say a doorway and access straight from uh, from outside. And then, as I say, little outhooks over there. Gate to the side and then the cab in here, which we'll be seeing it in a nice March morning. But uh, it's really pleasant and really pretty otherwise. Um, a good space. Got uh, just looking out up one of the open fields there, which 
that shed there and then just to look back on the house here so so that's it this is Cove Road in Malham um, if you're interested give us a call on 01756 701010 thanks for watching